This video is now brought to you by GeekRetreat.com Oh, what's up people? Dr. Wilson Sprite here and welcome to Pokemon Packaging. Yes, we're starting Pokemon today first. Before we start, please check out GeekRetreat.com. They are amazing. I've been going there nearly every single Sunday and Thursday to do the Yu-Gi-Oh! tournaments. I don't do Pokemon tournaments because I can't play it to save my life. Anyhow, today... The reason why I'm starting to do Pokemon first off, because it is a bit smaller for Pokemon this month. But besides that as well, it is October, because for November and December, I'm trying to do something special for you guys. Open up some big, massive products, mostly in December, so I'm getting myself prepared for that. But anyhow, to start this month off, we open up something a little bit old. And you can tell it's old because there's dust. <laughs> These are the Tapu Koko and Mimikyu Pin Collection boxes. These came out back in Sun and Moon uh, Guardian Arise, which is quite insane, ladies and gentlemen. I don't what year was these? These were year 2017. Holy crap, people! 2017. So that's 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. That's five years ago people I've had these sitting here for five years and it's time to open them up today am I hoping to get anything good out of these it's hard to say ladies and gentlemen because like I said these are old the pull rates were a little bit different back in the day but still it's good to open them up right here right now and just to tell you truthfully people if you want to know how much these packs are worth now uh, I don't want to add, I don't want to say because I bet some of these card, these packs in here could possibly worth quite as, a lot more instead of opening them. So, yeah, oh god. So, Tapu Coco has one of the worst packs in the game, Steam Siege, which is disgusting. But Mimikyu looks like it's got a fantastic pack. Fates collide. Alrighty then. Let's go ahead and uh, pop out the hollow. Sadly, because they've been sat in the box for five years, the hollow is not its fantastic form of um, straight. Let's have a Tapu Coco. Tapu Coco Tapu Coco's really good, but he's a little bit bent. But like I said, a massive heavy book can definitely um, straighten it out. But either way, you get yourself the Tapu Coco. There's the price for it. And here is the Mimikyu. That's the price for it. Now remember, people, prices do are varied of course so if you want to make sure make sure you research them another time because as i'm recording it the packs will the um, the price of the um products will be different massively okay so please be warned yeah let's go get these other packs so you get yourself quite so we get add them on we get six packs okay so that's very good to be honest and sadly my bin has gone walkabout so I have to really be careful where I throw my booster packs now <laughs> but anyhow you get yourself two packs of sun and moon and the fates collide from the uh, from the uh, Mimikyu but from Tapu Coco you get yourself a steam siege a sun and moon guardian rising two of them okay so I'm gonna start I'm gonna actually have fates collide last because that's actually a really, really good pack but well, we're starting off with Steam Siege, and as you guys know, I always slag off Steam Siege, and all of some weird reason, they give me the best pulls of all time. Does it still happen though? If it does, it'll be an absolute joke, to be honest, because I'm telling it now, Steam Siege, you suck! You're awful! You're the worst! Nope, it's gotta be the right way around, so it'll be here, I think. I don't know if I've done the car trick correctly. It must be three from the back this time instead of four. We'll find out in a minute if there's any reverses. Okay. Charlotte. A reverse foil Infernape. That's good. And a Hollow Ray Veltal. Okay. So, yeah. So it is three from the back instead of it being four. Because you don't guarantee, um, you never guarantee a, um, a energy card so that's not bad first pack out of, an, out of a, a bit of an old retro pack a reverse for a rare and a Veltal holo rare really good next up though guardians rising quite a good set i liked it some people say it wasn't really the best but still though i enjoy it very much so let's see what we can get out of this one i have to definitely throw away the packs 
a little bit further away, that one there, there we go. We got Sligoo, we got Energy Lotto, Sableye, Nosepass, Wimpod, Goomy, Wilmer, Beldum, a Reverse World Castworm, and a Holloway Demalis, which you don't really see. Oh, there's an Energy card. Okay, <laughs> so that one's fourth to the back then, okay. I need to remember how they do. So, not bad, so two for two, that's actually really, really good. Was not expecting that. Now you might be thinking, it is a bit awkward for me opening up a retro pack because I would try not to open up old packs <laughs> when they're actually full on, 100% out printed. You know, you know, if they're out of print. So it scares me to open these up because these actually worth quite a bit of money now. But hell of it, you guys deserve a bit of a retro pack opening, don't you? I'm sure you do. But anyhow, here's your code. And it's gone. One, two, three, four then, by the look of it. There we go. A Lampant, Clefable, a Marini, a Geodude, Muldbury, a Mudbury, a Sandshrew, Cotney, Bellsprout, a Reverse Foil Sudarudo. Sudarudo! I love, I love making voices out of the um, Pokemon doll. I like it. And an Ole Oricorio! Oh, there we go. Good, a good rare to be honest. I actually do like Oricorio. Next up, Sun and Moon Base Set. An amazing set to be honest. I really do love the base set of Sun and Moon. It's so good. I enjoyed it a lot. I opened up quite a lot of these though back in the day. So it's good to open up a few more before it all goes bye bye. Uh, yep, there we go. There's the um, energy card. Spinder. Potion, Hypno, the Mr. Pedophile himself, uh, Sandile, Meowth, that's right, Picky Peck, Eevee, Psyduck, a Reverse Roll Rare Candy, and Incineroar. Okay. Next pack of Sun and Moon. Can we get anything else? Now, you might be thinking, people, how is my luck been doing recently? I tell you truthfully, people, um, I'll tell you more about it when we move on to the Yu Gi Oh side of the pack openings. But. Oh my goodness people, my luck has been insane off camera besides us recording videos. Hey, we get King Julian! I like to move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. You like to move it! Oh, never mind. Well, at least we get Mr. Uh, Professor Kakui Kakashi. Awesome. Um, so yeah, I will tell you more about it during the Yu-Gi-Oh side because it was insane. Massive story to tell you about that. Final pack, people. Fates Collide. This is a banging set, people. A fantastic set. Super rare. Hard to come by. It's X and Y, so it is about two, three generations away. So it is quite old, so let's just go through it a little bit slower. Diggler, Spoink, Riolu, a Reverse Foil Rare Lucario, that is nice. And an Aerodactyl Rare. To be honest, I cannot complain. For old packs that probably don't guarantee any big hollows, I'm happy. Very happy. Two Reverse Foil Rares and two hollows, cannot complain there. Before we say goodbye, let's see what we pulled today. We have ourselves Kakui Kakashi with Verse Foil, Rare Candy, Sudo Rudo, and Caspor. And then for Verse Foil Rares of the day, we have ourselves Lucario and Infernape. And then for Hollow Rares of the day, we have ourselves our Anchorman himself, Mimikyu, Tapu Koko, and Eveltal. If you guys enjoyed it, I surely did. Make sure you comment down below. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. Around about 87% of you are not subscribed, so what the hell are you lot doing? Subscribe if when you're watching us. And also, please check out geekretreat.com. They are amazing all year round, and they help me to get these, these type of products. With that being said, the people I'm still to you guys subscribing, and I'll see you guys next time. Cheerio! It is fun opening up some old stuff, but still though, wasn't really worth opening it because they are expensive products. Never mind, but I enjoyed it. I like getting these, these are nice. I don't have a clue what the values are, but I'm sure they'll pop up right now. Ah! Ah!